Today, we did lesson 412. We did, it was the decimal addition algorithm. So you were able, we reviewed how to add whole numbers, and then we used that to add with decimals. So we know we have to line everything up. So if we have 783 plus 200, 15, I can do 700 plus 280 plus 10, and 3 plus 5, and then add them all together. So how that would look for a decimal is making sure we line it up. So let's say we had 3 and 72 hundredths plus Two and forty seven hundredths, and that they're all lined up, and I can add them. So, three, two plus seven is nine, seven plus four is eleven, and I'd have to carry my one. Three plus two is five, plus one is six. So, let's take a look at our homework. Yeah. Mr. Board has to figure out which one it is. So it is going to be this one. Not that one, because that is 3, 4, 12. That was not 12, that was 13, so we need this one. No, not that one. Hmm. Ah, this one. So it says, for problems one through three, make an estimate and write a number sentence to show how you estimated. Then solve the problem using partial sums addition, column addition, or U.S. traditional. Use your estimate to check your answer. So my estimate, two and four tenths, I'm going to do, if I blow it up, I'm going to do two point two decimal zero, because four I round down, plus... 9 decimal 0 and round down, my answer is 11. So now let's check. 2 and 4 tenths plus 9 and 3 tenths. 4 plus 3 is 7. 2 plus 9 is 11. So, is that pretty close? You bet. So now do... Two and three on your own. So now, four and five say write a number model with a letter for the unknown, then solve. At the 2012 Summer Olympics in London, Usain Bolt won the men's 100 meter race with a time of 9 and 63 hundredth seconds, and the men's 200 meter race at a time of 19 and 32 hundred seconds. How long did it take the sprinter to run the two races combined? So my number, so that keyword combined tells me I need to add. So, nine, oops, didn't change my marker. Nine and 63 hundredths plus 19 and 32 hundredths equals, I'm going to do T for time. So my answer, let's line it up, 19 and 32 hundredths plus 9 and 63 hundredths equals 2 plus 3 is 5, 6 plus 3 is 9, my decimal point, 9 plus 9 is 18, I carry my 1, 1 plus 1 is 2. So my answer, if I write it in a different color for you to see, is 28 and 95 hundredths of a second. Try 5 on your own. I'm going to highlight what numbers you need. You need 44 and 5 tenths, 10 and 16 hundredths, and it says how far from the ground would the dog's head be if it stood on the horse's back? I'm going to tell you, you need to add those together. Your practice at the bottom. It says what is one half of 12? So... What is half of 12 is our question. 
So you can either write your problem like this, 12 over 2, which also means 12 divided by 2, and our answer is 6. Then you have what is 1 half of 11, and what is 1 fifth of 11. Those are the ones you need to try on your own.